Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. So in today's video, I'm going to talk about why YouTube is harder than TikTok. Because I got a lot of people, a lot of my friends saying TikTok's harder than YouTube. I watch a lot of YouTube shorts, I have TikTokers. Like there's this one girl that pops her head up and down for how many seconds? I don't know. And gets 18 million likes. So then you got us, who works days upon days upon days. Like, some videos even take a whole week to do. And I'm not talking just about myself. I'm talking about other YouTubers as well. Such as Mark Parr. I know his videos take a long time to upload. What else? There's my friend, Azol. He only has 200 subscribers, and he works on his videos. Like, it's no one's business. Like... We, we were all, and then we, we, do we get, we barely push out, or I'm just going to say of my player, he barely pushes out 400k, barely, barely, for a video that probably took him and his editor a week to two, two days, a day to two, one week to do, like, and then how long, I asked my friends, how long does a normal TikTok take, and he said about a half an hour to an hour. Maybe longer, depending on what it is. I'm like, okay, you're saying TikTok's hard? <laughs> like, we work way harder. Because you get to do in like 30 seconds. Like, TikTok Live's another thing, but who watches those? And plus, TikTokers copy the exact same thing as other ones do. Because I know there's TikTok dances going around. That's another deal. But then you got YouTubers who do, do they do copy. But they do it in their way. YouTube usually, I know Eamon, what he does. Eamon, a big guy, a big YouTuber with 400k. He looked, he got one of his late, latest videos from Daco, and you can see the re, the watch bar was only was barely filled, barely. Wanna know why? Because he looked at the game and said this would be cool to play, and he did it. Clueless. He entered the game cluelessly. Like us YouTubers, we try so hard to amuse you guys. For only, for me, I only barely push out two, barely, maybe even one on worst videos. Like, wow, what? Like the shit. Like, we work harder than usual TikTokers do. Like, edits? Maybe. Maybe edits work a little bit harder than we do. Maybe. Because edits, I know how long they could take. Drawings, same thing. But dancing should not take that long to do. Our videos. And you want to know how much retakes I had to do for one simple video? For the Star Wars... Clone Wars never ends. That one specifically took me around 50 tries to get right. Because I wanted it so I wouldn't die. That took me 50 tries to do. Then I'm like, oh, uh, the video's blurry. Which got me pretty pissed. Because all those 50 tries went to waste. But I'm like, who cares? Like, most YouTubers probably take longer to perfect. Like, you're... <laughs> And, you're, and people are saying, yeah, TikTok's easy. TikTok's hard. And then there's some people that say, yeah, YouTube's harder. Which is honestly, they're not wrong. They're not wrong. It's actually pretty easy. If you actually get used to it, it gets pretty easy. But then again, YouTube. Back to YouTube. Like... We, our videos, live streams, I'm not going to count, because live streams you do in one shot, because they're, all, they're live. I'm not going to count any sort of live streams, because they're just done on the spot. But even though, TikTok live streams, what are they known for? NPCs. I'm not going to say YouTube, is probably, I, know, I think some YouTubers have done that. 
but most YouTubers see it as a shame that some YouTubers are changing into TikTokers. They see sh- most YouTubers see shame in that. Like I see shame. Like well, I'm fine with people doing TikTok, but most YouTubers quit YouTube to do TikTok because it's better. And I'm sitting here like that's that's a disgrace. Like you worked so hard on videos, and now you're gonna go to a platform that's easier to do. That's a disgrace. Because us small YouTubers here are sticking to what we do best, which is gaming most of the time. Some, like, green screen kids, you could get out of here. Uh, you don't work hard on your stuff, so. But, again, like, our videos, my videos approximately take me, the edited ones take me longer because I have to perfect every single spot. Like, that Minecraft video that I just released took me, actually, no. You get better yet? The FNAF video. You wanna know how long that took me? Two hours. You know how much editing that was? Not that much. But the thing with the Nightmare Chica jump scare took me the longest time. The like the nail in intro, the old intro that I had months ago. I don't even know if most of you remember. It took me so long to do that. Like, really, really long to do. And you got me, like, and got YouTubers are leaving for, like, okay, if you're gonna do some videos, if you're gonna still release, like, re- if, like, if, I don't even know. T- people that s- say that TikTok's harder, go fuck yourselves. Like, literally. Our videos take. Longer than yours do. Than shorts that take 30 seconds to do. Maybe a minute. Probably 30 to an hour. Because you have to edit and choose the song and everything. In perfect dances. But then you got us. Emily's a whole different deal though. Um, she's a YouTuber, TikToker. I'm just going to say that. Uh, Emily's a different deal though. I'm um, not saying that she's bad. Not saying that she's bad. No, nope. I'm <laughs> not saying that she's bad. I'm not saying that. I'm not saying that she's bad. She's a good YouTuber. And then you got my friend, Chloe. Some of her stuff makes me cringe. I'm just gonna say that. Some of her stuff makes me cringe. As old Flaco, I actually love his channel. I'm gonna link his, I'm gonna link his on YouTube channel down below. You should go subscribe to him. He's awesome he's an epic dude honestly he's an epic dude he does a lot of plane content though so if you like planes nascar um horror stuff too he does he does pretty much everything but he mainly sticks to planes because well it's in its name as old flight co flight and co Ivory's corporation as all flight corporation and then you got me who has a uh, Three different channels. One for the racing, because I think that's been getting out of hand for this channel. Um, the music channel, which I'll link in the description again. Same as my racing one, and then you got this one. And then you go on SoundCloud, which is not very used. It's actually used by lots of people. But Spotify has taken that. Then you got me on SoundCloud, publishing all my music on there, too. But... Everyone that just says that YouTube's easier is, I don't even know. Like, why are you saying TikTok's harder? Like, and that YouTube's easy, like, you just do record and then publish it. No, that's, like, TikTokers usually think that all we do is just, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna publish, we're gonna record a video, we're gonna publish it, we're gonna edit it, and you're gonna publish it. That's not easy. Like, a video lasts around 8 to 30 minutes. I'm going to even take Mark Clark's video. 40 minutes. Imagine imagine a TikToker editing 40 minutes. Not saying that they probably couldn't do it, but they could. But they get bored really fast. Because there's no dances in it. 
they even got a girl crying over losing 1 million subscribers. Which I think it was Charlie D'Amelio. And then you got us small YouTubers who lose one subscriber and we're like, okay. And you got like a lot of us, like a lot of us smaller YouTubers. We we're making fun of Charlie D'Amelio. You're losing one subs one million followers versus us having like seventy seven two hundred. Like, stop. TikTok is just be just because you lost one million subscribers, followers, doesn't mean you could bitch and cry about it. And I know I'm gonna get comments saying, why are you gonna bully her like that? Because I'm a person with 77 subscribers at this point. I've lost so much subscribers in the past probably year. And then I think I've lost I've I I had it my 77 is my mark that I finally hit. I'm working on getting a hundred now. That's gonna be hard though. But like losing a million to me would be nothing to me. Cause I know I could always try and try again. And that there's eight billion people in this world. And that a million just losing a million of them doesn't mean you're gonna lose eight all eight billion. Us small YouTubers have hope that we can get bigger. That there's a reason why we're making fun of her. It's because we know we can do. We know that we can do better. And we know that girl, that Charlie D'Amelio is just crying because she lost one million. Yeah. Like, I know that's kind of, that can be heartbreaking. But a small, like, look at us. Take a lot of us, for example. Like, we try our lives out. Like, we start out from zero. It took me. Almost. I started in 2019. I released my first video in 2019. Which all my videos the, since 2020 got deleted. Because I wanted a fresh restart. But a lot of you that were part of the 13 subscribers. I remember very clearly having 13 when I first. You probably all know. Remember that old video. But like YouTubers. Like TikTokers have it easy. Compared to us. YouTubers. Like you want to. TikTokers usually get about 100. 1k in about a month. Maybe two. Depends on how trash your content is. But us YouTubers, it takes at least five years. 1K. COVID was a sprout, though, because, well, COVID. COVID boosted our numbers because, well, not me, because I wasn't recording that at that time. Yep. Um, I should have recorded and started recording earlier. So a lot of people, a lot of YouTubers started getting just, was just a gain, subscriber game for them. Because, well, a lot of TikTokers lost ideas because they couldn't go outside. And then you got us YouTubers like, yeah, fuck you. You can't do anything indoors. You can dance indoors. But then you got us. So you have to, we stay indoors for a living. Well, I wouldn't say all of us. Because there is some YouTubers that go outside. But I think they compensated for playing games at that point. Like, a lot of us YouTubers try so hard to make people have fun. Shows for us to... Like, that's Star Wars. That me? I was so happy getting the 912 videos on one of my... On the Star Wars video. I was so happy. Because I know... I... I was losing hope at that point. Like, I was gonna, I was saying, is there even, like, I know there was people out there. And I'm like, is this video even gonna do good? Because my last 10 videos did not do good at all. And that one did outstandingly well. Like, I didn't even know how good that was. And it was all because of the name, I think. Maybe. I don't know. But, like, TikTokers have it easy. And they complain a lot. Like, why? Like, why? Like, why? 
here's her complaining that we were like, it's so hard to publish on TikTok. And I know there's, like, I'm not going to count live streams, because live streams are, you do it in one shot. If you mess up, you mess up. And us YouTubers. <laughs> there's some days where we barely get any sleep. Barely. Want to know why? Because we're working hard. Freaking harder than, um, Bob the Builder. We're trying to get the video perfect for you guys to watch. And making it so it's perfect for you guys to be happy. And then, yeah. oh, it's so hard to publish TikTok. Mm. So you're saying, me staying up pretty much all night, editing a video to make it so it's perfect for you guys to watch, is not as easy. Like, why? Like, TikToker, I know I'm going to get a lot of TikTokers in the comments saying, me, 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 me. Don't. I don't want to hear it. Stop your bitching. Stop complaining. Stop, stop doing stuff. Like, I don't care if you do TikTok. Just stop complaining about how hard it is. Okay? Hmm, okay.